seeing some relative humidity on the up and up, and uh, we're seeing more moisture out there, cooler temperatures. That is helping things, and so far our fire danger uh, moving into this afternoon really sits for the southeastern corner of the state. Uh, we could see some pop-up showers, some breezy conditions there. That's really about it. Heading into our Wednesday afternoon, a better chance to see some thunderstorms starting, and that's exactly what caused the Joseph Canyon fire uh, was a spark of lightning. So we do need to watch these cells carefully as they cruise through the east sides of the state tomorrow afternoon. Uh, we'll see a chance uh, of some of that lightning possibly starting or sparking new fires out in the very dry area here of eastern Oregon. So we'll track that into our day tomorrow. Right now we are seeing some rain around the region. Very light showers mainly over the higher terrain of the coast range. Also out towards the Cascades. We're seeing a mix of clouds and some sunshine now here in Portland and down the valley. Beautiful move into our afternoon now. 61 degrees and a great day to dine out on the patio. As we head towards our evening, we will track some pop-up showers that may work in. As you can see from our coin tower cameras, breaks in the clouds, some bubbly cumulus clouds out there. It is looking nice as we head into our lunch hour. Temperatures will start to bump towards the upper 60s today, and that is still cooler than we should be in June. In fact, we should see the low 70s. So a nice cooler week ahead coming after last week. I think today, last week, we hit 95 degrees for a new record high. So we are running about 30 degrees cooler than last week going into today. Again, a chance for pop-up showers we head towards about 4 or 5 o'clock, maybe even earlier in the afternoon for areas around the valley. So here's your rainfall future cast. This weather, weather model again still pulls in some of those light scattered showers that will quickly pass by through the afternoon here. So still tracking some unsettled conditions. Notice all the rain showers out over the Cascades and uh, even out towards areas of central Oregon today. As we head towards Wednesday morning, starting off dry, likely some sunshine, but by the afternoon, more showers continue continue to develop here. So we'll continue with that unsettled weather. Patchy showers through the afternoons almost every single day this week. Same goes for Thursday too, a dry start and a few showers likely working in. I do see Thursday a little drier than the rest of the week here. We'll likely stay mostly cloudy. A lot of that rain uh, staying up for the higher terrain, both in the coast range and the Cascades come Thursday. But on Friday, we're tracking a stronger weather system. There you see it swirling away. There's that center of low pressure. Uh, here's the cold front with that. So right now that will scoot in. It looks like Friday morning right around 9 o'clock or so. We may see some heavier showers pushing in. There's still a chance that this weather system breaks apart and we don't see much rain at all. But we're hoping we get the rain since we haven't seen much so far this season. So we'll watch again uh, uh, heading into Friday for that rain to arrive. Here's our thunderstorm potential again Wednesday. May see some thunderstorms out towards the east sides of the state here. Uh, could see an active afternoon. Quick look at our seven day forecast. Scattered showers throughout the afternoons. Temperatures this week stay close to about 70 degrees, even the upper 60s. By the weekend, though, we're warming up likely an 80 degree day on Sunday. That's your forecast. We'll be right back.